everybody, it's Millie and welcome back to Millie's Island and today Millie has made an oopsie. Um, basically what happened was, remember at the end of the last video where I said that I would be furnishing my house? Yeah, I did do that and I recorded myself doing it, but what I did was I deleted the entire video. The 44 minute long video has been deleted off of my phone and I am just very upset by that because it really was a process to get this place looking as good as it does so all like the best i can do for you guys is to just walk through the house and um this is obviously my bed my bedroom here's my armor there's uh this is the armor i got from the the nether I didn't cheat i'm not a cheater my dice yeah i just moved everything to their respective spots. Yeah, so they got all of my items. And here's the downstairs. I'm actually in my roof that you guys saw me finish. You know, the one that the creeper walked across? Yeah, that one. And here I made a little kitchen. Um, my stuff, my smokers. I am just so upset that my uh, video got deleted. Barrel. I think I'm just gonna store bread and stuff in here because it just makes the most sense. Uh, this is like just the area where I craft and uh, smelt things. And then uh, this is my storage space. I'm definitely gonna run out of space soon, but I separated everything the best I could uh, because I was just really running out of space in my old house. So that this this is my my house i'm sorry i didn't get to show you for show footage of me furnishing it here's the outside again oh my gosh that is a creeper that is a creeper i'm just gonna guide this guy all the way down the island because i don't want him to mess up anything that i've touched yeah keep keep coming you think you can make it down here buddy good okay now let's just oh my gosh he still hasn't exploded yet good i killed two birds with one stone oh wow he actually could have destroyed everything and i would have been very upset oh get up here so yeah that is the ha that's my house tour um this is clearly too short to be an actual video, so I think I'm just gonna paste the paste uh the other well paste the actual episode after this. So um yeah, this has been a uh, past Millie, and thanks for watching my house tour. So I uh, this is something I did. I put a little canopy. Oh. I put a little cam canopy over the um the graveyard because animals just kept falling into it and I just didn't want anything stomping on my poppies so I put up a canopy just to prevent anything from like jumping down Um I think that's I think that's all of the all of the pre-video interruptions so on to the video for real this time Howdy, it's Millie and welcome back to Millie's Island. Today I'm going to be doing something that I've been putting off um, ever since I forgot what episode it was but what I will be doing is I'm going to be moving the uh finally moving the nether portal. That's what I want to say. Um part of me is hoping that when I move the nether portal it moves uh where I spawn because um Although in the last video I did, oh, it's nighttime. Uh, oh, but although I did uh, feel like I did a lot of work on it while I was in the Nether in the last episode, I feel like um, I just really want a new spawn because I feel like I can't progress unless I find a Nether fortress. So I'm hoping moving the portal in the Overworld at least will solve that problem. Um, and I already have my pickaxe because I think that's all I need. Got some food. Scra oh my gosh. My inventory is not organized. I will be right back.
Oh no! Stop! 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 I couldn't do anything because I don't want to kill the wolf, but I also didn't want to let the fox die. Guess I'll just have to live with that. Now oh, this flower can just be placed. Seeds, they can stay. This crafting table can stay. Charcoal can stay, obviously. Okay, well. Anyways. Um, yeah, that's when I'm gonna move the portal. I have my pickaxe with me already because I didn't want to do too much with the chest stuff, even though I literally just emptied out my inventory. I'm not bringing my armor today because I have a feeling I'm not going to be needing it. I am really hoping that moving the nether portal in the overworld will uh, allow me to actually, you know, spawn somewhere else in the nether because I just don't like the area that I'm at. Yeah, it has those beautiful warped trees, but I don't have like a nether fortress and that's what I need, a nether fortress. Oh gosh, I'm about to crash. Okay. And we're back on track. I feel like I'm going slower than usual on this boat. Maybe it's just me. Like, I haven't gone boating in a while, but it feels like I'm going slower. And we are approaching the nether portal. Wow, I didn't realize it was this far ahead. I'm telling you, when I haven't been on this game um, since before I recorded that uh, last video, I'm, I'm being for real. But okay, we're here, and we're going to mind the nether portal. Mm. Oh, let's see if I left anything behind. Nope. Here's to hoping that it's spawned, that I spawned in a different place. Because I did not like the way the, the piglins treated me last ep last episode. And I will do anything to spawn, like, nowhere near them. Twelve? I don't remember only needing twelve. Oh yeah, because I cut off the corners. Alright, so we've secured the obsidian, and we're just going to... Ow! Find my boat. Here it is. <gasps> oh no, I placed one underwater! Ew! Okay, let me mine this real quick. Okay, got it. Let's head back. I'm just going to cut to where I'm at my house. Doc, sweet doc. Okay, we made it home safely. Um, now we're just going to place the portal. I'm thinking that I should just put it somewhere behind my house or nearby. Because I actually, on my way here, I was thinking about what, like, if I were to build a portal room for the portal, what would it look like? And I think I'm going to plan one in my sketchbook world and try and get the materials. So, hmm. I think the portal room should be over here since it's, there's just enough blank space. Oh, I don't have flint and steel. Let me go make some. But yeah, um, I was, I, I was thinking if my portal's gonna be over here, I might as well make it look pretty. Don't mind the noises. They're very obnoxious and they don't, they won't go away. Let's do it. Put that away because I have fire spreads on. Now let's build this portal. And I really, really hope that I spawn in a different area. That would just be mwah, chef's kiss. Hope I'm doing this right. Oh, come on. That is the worst. And it takes so long. Okay. Or maybe it doesn't. Maybe I'm just impatient. Four 
blocks high, add a cobblestone, one, two, that looks about right, break off all the, why do I have two extras then? I guess I can... There we go. Okay. Let's see where we appear. Please do not be in that cave or I'll be very upset. Oh. Oh, come on. I did all that work for nothing. And it's still... It sounds like those guys are still down here. Ooh, I just had an idea. Like, what if I put ne put nether portals, like, all over the map so, like, I knew where to teleport? Like, if I... Because you know how you travel in the nether? It's, like, I think farther. Every... Every... Something is, like, farther than walking on the overworld. So if I were to put a portal right here and a portal right here, I would, um, res I would enter the, the overworld in two different spots. That's what I'm saying. So what if I put nether portals all over the nether? And then like, if I wanted to teleport to the mushroom island, I would have a mushroom island uh, nether portal. Or if I wanted to teleport to the, the uh, my, my island or the village, there would be another portal for each place. Ooh, that's actually an idea. I'm gonna test that out on like, on like a random creative world and then see if I can implement, it. oh my gosh. Nope, this is not this is not one of those videos where I die. Bye. Oh, okay, yeah. We're getting out of here. But yeah, wouldn't that be a really good idea? I'm going to see if that works. Cuz I could just be just making something up. I don't know. I don't think I've seen anyone do it before. <gasps> Wait a second. Gold. Wait, why do I care about gold? Speaking of like being in nether, I I'm just getting frustrated that I am just I did all that work and I'm nowhere near closer to getting to the uh nether portal. And I don't know like where would I start in looking for one? So like maybe if you guys know how I could find another portal. Not another for portal, but a fortress. <gasps> oh my gosh. Guys, I just respawned in a random spot. No, I just respawned over here without my boat. What in the world? Well, there you go. That's that's how you teleport in this game. That's that's what I was talking about. So I know it works. But I'm in the middle of nowhere, and there's where the portal used to be, and there's where they spawned me at. I did not know that the Nether could do that. Oh my gosh, is that a piglin, or is that just a skeleton with? Oh wait, I don't have armor on. I can't afford to start fighting, especially if my spawn point is back at my house. So I'm just I'm just gonna go to sleep in the village in my guest house. Ooh, maybe um you guys want to see me do a video of like decorating or remodeling the guest house. Probably not, but I'll do it anyways. Are the villagers still alive? I'll check in the morning. Is there anything in here? Oh, I have no bed! Okay, I'm gonna have to bunk with somebody else. This is not good. I have a bed in, I have a bed in here? Nope. What are you doing, Millie? Look, I did not know. That I was gonna get teleported out of out into the grass fields when I entered that nether portal. So when I get home, the first thing I'm doing is that I'm breaking that portal down. Excuse me? Sorry, I'm just gonna take your bed.
Okay, I'm back alive. Worst case scenario, I'm gonna have to sacrifice my diamond uh, pickaxe. Not all of you, all three of you shooting at me at once. Where's the iron golem? Why are you over there? You should be helping us. Uh-uh, I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Eat. Eat. Oh, I'm full, but I'm also low on my health. Oh, okay, okay. I can't believe the iron golem isn't helping. Well, while we wait, um, where was I? I was saying, yes, okay, I was saying that I could sacrifice my diamond pickaxe by going, by just leaving it in the nether by jumping into the lava. So at least if I break the portal, I won't respawn in that spot. And I will have a chance of, oh, okay, good, you're doing your job. But I don't want to do that because that's my only portal. Ooh. But yeah, for sure. First thing uh, I'm doing when I get home is breaking that, uh, breaking that portal because it's useless. I can't do anything with it. Like if every time I enter the Nether, I'm gonna pop up here in the. In the grasslands instead of at my house? No, thank you. Okay, so. Hmm. Well, my plans have been foiled. But I will figure it out. I. I. I don't know how I'm gonna break the portal. I could break it with my bare hands or with a pickaxe. You know what? I'm gonna do that. I have enough juice in my iron. So let me let me bring a bed over there. Enter the nether. Sleep and then okay, yeah, yeah. Break the portal and exit. So like if I were to break this portal, it's gonna take a while because I don't have the proper tools. But if I could if I do this correctly, I I will no longer spawn over there. But I don't know if this is a good or bad thing because... Oh, wait. You know what? I'm not going to break this one. I'm going to go to my house and break the other one. I don't know. I just hate that I'm all the way over here. Hmm. Let me craft a bed. I might craft a boat. Oh, I actually like the design of this boat. I need food. I like the pink hue of it. Ooh, actually, while we're um, in the middle of nowhere, um, I I redesigned the Millie's Island logo twice, but I actually really like the one that I settled on. All right. We've arrived and now we have two boats, which I'm not complaining. So I'ma just mark my spawn point and go to the nether. Wait, I have a feeling, I don't remember if I commented on this, but briefly after I did that intro, I, I decided to tunnel through for some reason because I thought it would look nice. And yeah, I did that. I don't know. I don't remember if I said anything about it. So, sleep here. I have a third bed. So, I'll keep that. Set. Make sure my spawn point is set. Um, I'm going to need a spare chest. Just so I could throw all my things in there. And I will... I need to remember to take my map out. Because I absolutely refuse to lose my map in the nether. Especially if I plan on breaking the portal. 
Let's drop all these goodies into the chest. Make sure that no armor is on. Okay, let's go. I'm not sure if I can fully break the portal with an iron pickaxe, but here's to hoping. Because I really don't want to respawn over there. Wait, is it even doing damage? Oh, it is, but it's going very slowly. I'll speed it up for your convenience. One block down, 12 to go. Oh wait, no, I did it. Yeah, you only need to break one. So I'm just gonna, first of all, say goodbye to my levels. Oh, I'm level 13 and it's about to be all gone. But it's okay, we'll earn more. Make sure nothing is in my inventory. Wait, what was that? Oh my gosh, that's my view from the, uh... <laughs> wow, that's cool. Okay. Wait, actually, let's see how far we can go in the nether without dying. Because, you know, maybe we'll stumble upon something. I'll keep that. Oh, no, I might not be coming back here. Nope, that's the area I died at. I like how I'm just supposed to be jumping into the lava, but I'm just making things complicated. Hmm, where do I go? Ooh, ow. Humming, humming, I'm bored. <laughs> My luck, there's nobody down here. Maybe I'll find the fortress just by jumping around. I. There's a hoglin stampeding towards me. Parkour! Ooh, what's this way? Now see, that's my problem. I haven't ventured far enough. And I already broke the portal. I wonder what's over there. So I'm going to try and reach that hoglin. I'm just going to ignore it. Nothing over there. Oh boy. Piglins, they're worse than hoglins, 100%. Oh well. You only live once in Minecraft. I'm trying to die anyways. Oh! No. No, 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 no. Please. Oh, man. Respawn. Okay. So I lost all of that stuff. But it's okay, because I didn't need it. So now, if I want to go over to that part of the nether, I just go through the uh, p the village portal. Pig. And if I want to come over here, use this portal. So we're going to see where this portal takes us. Now that the other one is broken. Ooh, we spawned in a different place. It still looks just like it's the same general area, though. But honestly, I don't know. It could be a different spot. We still have these beautiful warped trees. Here's a view. Now that's a thumbnail shot. But I, I feel like I've done uh, too many nether portals. Nether thumbnails. You know, the golden ones. Ah, it looks like I've been here before. It looks like this is the place I was at already, but I'm only basing that off of the trees. And, ooh, XP! XP! There's a lot of stuff to mine. I'm just really... I don't have anything to lose 
at this current moment so i'm just hopping around hoping i stumble upon another uh fortress this is soul sand it's making me go slow um nothing that looks like the area where i was running Ooh, i almost fell what's this oh well minecraft just decided to spawn these guys in Okay, that's annoying. <laughs> so much for another exploration. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it put a smile on your face. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.